Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how I did my makeup as a wedding guest and what I wore to that wedding. Uh, so I'm helping out my friend as a wedding organizer today. So and I did my hair and my makeup already and so I'm gonna show you quickly. This is how I did my hair. I just tied it in half and I use hair extension and this dress is from Avenue, it's like off shoulder and I'm wearing new palm from Nine West and I've been not wearing this kind of palm or high heels for about two and a half years already so hopefully everything is okay So the night before I did my nails uh, it's a gel nail from Natural Republic so I did that for my hands and my feet Hack number two is to use ice cubes so the function is to reduce any puffiness on your face. This will also wake you up because it's really cold. So I'm just going to show you what my hair looks like after I use hardening for overnight. And I usually do this before I curl my hair with curling iron so my curl can last longer. Next, I'm going to use moisturizer to prep my skin. I'm using Fresh Moisturizer and it's the Vitamin Nectar one. I like the Lotus one as well but today I'm just going to use this one. Next, after I'm done, I'm gonna wait until the moisturizer is a bit dry, even though it's not too dry. And then I'm gonna do my eyes first. So I'm gonna use my eye primer from Urban Decay. So I'm gonna wait until it's a bit dry and not too wet before I put on my eyeshadow. So next, I'm gonna put on my face primer. I love to use the Benefit one. It smells really nice and it can minimize my pore. For my eyes, I'm going to use eyeshadow from Naked Palette 3, so it's my favorite palette so far. And basically, I just create a dimension, a lighter colors at the front and deeper color at the back. And I'm going to fix that at the end usually and using eyeliner and eyebrow pencil. But now I'm going to do my face. First, I'm going to use my favorite foundation, which is Estee Lauder Double Wear. I'm using this foundation for a couple years now. I like the coverage and the makeup really lasts longer. And I'm using my beauty blender to blend in my foundation to my skin. And don't forget to damp out your beauty blender first with water. I know it looks really scary right now, but later on we're going to create dimension using blush on and contour. And for special event like this, it's really worth it to do these extra steps. Next, to cover up my imperfection, I like to use my NARS concealer. I usually use it under my eyes near my nose and near my mouth as well. Next, I like to use powder on my T-zone, which is my forehead, my nose, and my chin. And I'm using powder from Fenty Rihanna. I like to use it under my eyes as well. Next, I'm gonna fix my eyeshadow a little bit with Urban Decay Fives 2. And I'm gonna use this rose gold color and then those gold in the middle and deeper brown color at the back. Next, I'm going to use my favorite eyeliner, which is from Kat Von D. It's a tattoo liner. I have to do it on the side because I have to look at the mirror for eyeliner and my fake eyelashes. So for my eyebrow, I like to use eyebrow pencil from the face shop. It's really cheap. It's only 6 bucks. And sometimes they have like buy one, get one free. So it's only 3 bucks. I used to use Yes Lauren eyebrow pencil before. It's like $40. So I switched with this one and I like this one better because it's easy to create Korean eyebrow with this one. On, I like to use Orgasm from NARS and also I'm not gonna stop there. I'm gonna create a contour in my face to create three dimension so it can make your face slimmer and I'm gonna use Kat Von D palette. I'm gonna use the color at the middle one which is the darker color and I'm gonna put those on my chin, my forehead, and also my nose so I can make my nose bridge look taller. Next, I'm going to use liquid lipstick from Kat Von D. For the final step, I'm going to use highlighter from Benefit. I'm also going to use Urban Decay All Nighter Spray so my makeup can last longer. Next, I'm going to do my hair. So I'm just going to do a full bang today with my round brush and I'm going to open up my Hardini so it as you can see, the curl looks really nice. But to make it last longer, I'm just going to use hair, hairspray first. And I'm going to curl it again with curling iron. 
but I don't have to start with zero because I use Hardini already and then after I'm done curling it I'm gonna use another hairspray for extra step you can also use hair extension if you want me to show you how to use the hair extension leave me a comment below and I'm gonna do another video for that so there you go this is the before and after one hour this is the after I'm ready for the party last but not least hack number four is to break your shoes so you can wear a thick sock and then use a hair dryer so you can make your shoes fit bigger uh, my shoe size went up by one size after I got pregnant and give birth so now I can wear my palm again I hope, I hope this video is useful and thanks for watching bye guys